Uh, hey guys, this is Diego Diablo from MySPaint.com and I just wanted to do a stream today. So I'm testing it out real fast. Everything seems to be working, which is good. And uh, give me one sec. So today I'm actually working on a um, custom painted helmet. Uh, it's Notre, Notre Dame, Notre Dame, Notre Dame. How do you ever really say it? It's a uh, custom painted softball helmet. And I just wanted to share this with you guys today. And uh, you know, I appreciate you coming and hanging out with me. I did a lot of these, was it just this weekend? Seems like a longer time ago, but it really wasn't. So I wanted to do this one real fast. Let me just pull up my screen so I can check the feed. But um, I painted this helmet and I actually started working on part of it already. As you can see, I did turn this down. So I did Notre, Notre Dame in the front and the top of it, I did the Fighting Irish kind of logo. So that's what I'm actually working on now. And um, blah, 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 blah. There you go, okay. So I can see it a lot better now. Make sure this works real fast. You can hear me better. Yeah. So I want to add some blue to this thing. I think so. Oh, I have green, actually. And the main colors are like a deep blue. And this is what I'm using is Wicked Blue. They have a Wicked Deep Blue, and I need some of that. But I think this will pull it off for what I'm doing right now. And I want to add some just different flame design see there, I think that's kind of cool. Give it some just, you know, some character. I designed these a couple days ago and I had a whole sheet of these smaller ones and I didn't know what I was going to use them on so I'm kind of, okay like cool I can use them on this and I think it'll look really cool as just like a s example of different uh, tribal designs. I have the main guy up there. This is kind of a glare, actually. I'm trying to get rid, rid of that. So, hey guys, thanks for checking me out. Hey, Jax, Kathleen. Hey, what's going, going on? Hello, Athena, Becky, Brandon, all you guys. Allison, hey, Silver Lion Man, what's going on? Jeff, uh, all you guys, thanks for checking me out. I'm painting a custom helmet right now. And I'm doing the Fighting Irish, so. Yeah, it's a huge fan base, especially if you're in the Midwest, in Indiana, whatever. A lot of, you know, it's right actually, amazing school. I actually applied to Notre Dame, but you have to, I mean, I had the grades to get in, but I couldn't afford it, but man, that's just an amazing school, amazing team, all that. I'm not really, I don't know that much about sports, but I do know they have, uh, you know, great stuff. So I'm adding some flame designs at the bottom around here. I was gonna freehand some, I, pro I know I will, because I can blend it in better. But right now, I just wanna kinda throw these across the helmet. And what this does is just fills in the gaps, gives it some nice, clean look, and uh, gives it some, gives you some, the eye to something to look at. Cause I see a lot of solid stuff, and it really, it drives me crazy when I do. Um, and that's just the way I work. I like to have a lot, you know. I like to do a lot. So throw some freehand ones in there. And I don't have my freehand flame stencil, which is just a bunch of curves, but I can just wing it literally with a wing. Okay, we'll do that. I try to plan out all my streams a lot, but sometimes like stuff like little stuff like this I just freehand. See right here the design. It's really dark right now and I'm gonna lighten it up and you'll see soon. So this is for one of my friend's kids, really good kid, and I wanted to do something cool for him. 
And uh, he watched my stream, so I thought, I'd be like, okay, cool, man. Let me do uh, a cool stream for you so you can see your helmet getting painted live. The funny thing about it was, I actually painted this one time before. It was already done, but I painted it. I had so many orders, I painted it on the wrong helmet, so I had to redo it over. And uh, I actually wasn't too mad because I kind of wanted it to do a better job this time. Because I'm really critical. So we're adding blue, and then there's a logo there. I'll probably blend some blue into here too. So the main colors are white, gold, and blue. And the really nice thing about this color is when you is that better? When you um, clear coat it, it comes out so nicely. It like the whole thing looks amazing. So that's what I really love about uh, the metallic colors when I paint them. I'm gonna add some words and stuff on the back here. I'm gonna switch to white in a minute. I just wanna get the rest of this paint on the helmet really fast before I do it. All right, cool. And that looks really cool. I like how that color comes out. And uh, I like whenever I'm painting, so here's a tip for anybody airbrushing. If you're painting hard surfaces, usually when I mean by hard, like a helmet, anything that needs to be clear coated, um, I like using the metallic colors. And here's a really cool color, like Wicked Paints. It's uh, like a gold color. And uh, I like using that. They're really thick paints to shoot out, but I like, I like using them because under this light, it's really cool reflectiveness and everything. And that's that. All right, cool. So let me lower this a little bit so you can see it. If I can, right here. All right, awesome. Then I'll add some white on here. Let me check that out one more time. Another Dame logo. Can't find it. I guess I'll just freehand it. That's fine. So I'll outline that fighting Irish guy. If you're just checking my channel, I'm painting a uh, Notre, Notre Dame, Notre Dame, uh, say it. fighting Irish logo, kind of helmets. Outlining everything. Using a Iwata Eclipse airbrush. I really like these airbrushes. I like Iwata a lot. So if any of you, and I have everything listed in my uh, description too, so you can check it out. If you're just wondering. So I'm just coloring it in. It's kind of like a coloring book in a way when you paint. So what I do, unlike, you know, coloring books that's already drawn out, you draw up the design, and you just kind of color, kind of color it in, you know? I always liked coloring books growing up as a kid. Well, you know, growing up, but as a kid, you know? Uh, I like filling in the puzzle to me, you know, with colors. It was like a problem to solve. I felt like I could solve it better than other people because I could see like, oh, you know, that color fit there. I think that's kind of how I knew I wanted to be an artist. And I see people that are good at something. They're like, you know, I got a friend that's a really good builder. I got a friend that can work on cars and all that stuff. So I think everyone has their thing that they're good at. And 
and uh, yeah. Put some squiggly lines on here. Tracy Tobo, hey, how's, how's it going, Tracy? What's up? What's up, Jax from Texas? How's everyone doing? Thanks for coming by, saying hi. I am actually working on a custom painted helmet. Fighting Irish, man. Any Fighting Irish fans out there? It's uh, Notre Dame. And the words on this, what is it gonna say? Blah, 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 blah. I have Galaxy. Clear this softball blue, teal, Notre Dame, Munster, Babe Ruth champions, okay, 2018. Munster. I'm like a freehand this right here. Cool. I usually just draw it once and then I'll take my time and I'll go over it whenever I do words. I really hate, when I started painting and airbrushing, I hated doing words because my handwriting was so bad and I read an article saying that, don't think of it as uh, hand drawing, I mean like writing a name, think of it as just drawing a name. So if you think of it like drawing, it's fine. So Munster. Babe, people are like you have such good handwriting. I'm like, no, I don't. If you saw my handwriting live, it's terrible. Ruth, Babe Ruth, champs, champs. Yeah, twenty eighteen. Hey, what's up, Janelle? What's going on, guys? Hey, what's up, Noah, man? Tony, Brittany, Janelle. Oh, you guys, thanks for joining me and checking out my channel. And right now, I'm actually working on a custom uh, softball helmet. My friend Noah, uh, for his son, I am designing and customizing a helmet because they're one of the champs, and that's really cool. It makes something really, really, really different. And, uh, I've made this one time before, and I'm actually kind of glad that I get to do it over because I want to do it a little better. And that's how I am. I'm just weird like that. Most people are like, oh, I have to do it over. I'm like, oh, I get to do it again, you know. So I want to add a little more different kind of stuff to it. So Munster, Babe Ruth, Champs 2018. Drop that in there, 2-0. And I'll do like a, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but I'll do like a little like box kind of look block litter design, just trying to change it up. It's really dark now, and then I'll add white to it to make it stand out. And see, the color's already in the background, which is a blue. And then the white just brings it out. So that way I don't have to go over it a bunch of times. And the blue is really nice and bright and stays that way. There you go. And then I'll trace over it in uh, white. So when I paint, I move super fast, but I'm really doing all these little things uh, that not a lot of people notice. Like going over it like three times, but it really makes it look nice though. So Ruth. Sometimes I go right to left, back. I don't know, it's weird. Sometimes I'm like, wow, that's weird. And then I'm like, oh, I don't really think of it. Or sometimes I'll work on something like upside down. My son is loving it, bro, things. Hey, no problem, man. So, and I think I like this one better. Anyways, so adding Munster and White. 
I might leave it white or gold. I don't know. We'll see how it looks in a sec. But I'm always encouraging people to really like try something different or draw and paint. You know? So I had a friend tell me that her friend is like a lot of wine and canvas nights and those are really super cool. Just something, you know, it's fun. I mean, it's fun. The front, the glare. Yeah. Give it like a little graffiti look. Adding kind of these swirls and all that stuff. Another one there. And that, there's no really rule to what I'm doing. I just try to balance it. Well, there are rules, like balancing it out. So if I do it to one side, I'll do it to this side. And um, even if it's not perfectly symmetrical, it still solves the problem of being balanced and it feels right. What's up guys? Hey, what's up Twitch? Rudy. <laughs> All right, man. Snarch the priest. Okay. I like that name. That's cool. Yeah, man, Rudy. I'm in the Midwest. So this is actually uh, really popular here. Depending on where you're watching. I got a lot of friends watching from like the West Coast uh, out in Texas, California. And um, I think maybe a few on the east, I think. Uh, so that's always cool. And um, adding black now. And this will just make everything, it'll outline everything, make a pop. So like the drop shadow. Here. Here. Just underneath the letters where you'll leave a shadow. I'll add that. And let me look at the logo real fast again too. So I know where it goes, man. Actually, let me look it up over here real fast. Notre Dame, Notre Dame, logo. Because I know there's to do the logo, L-O-G-O, that's right. Okay, L-L-O-G-O. No, okay, that's how it is, okay. Uh, I thought there was like a line in between there or something, but no, that's how it looks. That's cool. All right. Oh, the Irish dude has like some gold in his hat. Oops, okay. I'll add that. Some gold. Speaking of leprechauns, I used to watch when I was little, I mean, remember the movie The Leprechaun? That was like super scary. And uh, I don't know, I just thought about that. Random, but I thought about it. Okay, adjust it right there. Give him a beard, outline him, his eyes. Just tracing around it, man, having fun. Give him some fists. Cause he's always fighting. Cause he's a leprechaun. The little clover. I think it's like a three. I don't think it is a four-leaf clover, is it? Okay, a little clover. I thought it was. 
What's up guys, what's going on? Thanks for checking me out, I appreciate it. And if you're just checking me out, uh, I'm doing a custom softball helmets with the Fighting Irish. So, thanks for joining me and checking me out. Drop a like, share, all that good stuff. Helps out my channel, helps other people see it. Appreciate it a lot. All right, that's cool. Notre Dame threw some flames on it and everything and uh, added Babe Ruth Munster. Oh, actually, you know what? Let me do, let me, yeah, let me add like a gold in there. Let me see, a gold or something? I think that would be cool. Um, yeah, that'd be cool. Some lightning. Some crazy lightning outside of here. I found this template and I was looking for it and I was like, all right, I need to use this one. All right, and I'll use like a brighter gold so it'll contrast the other one so it'll be seen better. I do, 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 do. Where is that color? It's like a, uh, this color? No, let's see, here it goes. A wicked golden yellow? Yeah, there you go. Babe Ruth are this is like a semi-transparent color, and if you go over a white with it, it's a lot brighter. So that's why I made the white. I knew I was gonna go over with another color to make it stand out from the blue. Just a little bit just to make it pop goes a long way, man. I'll leave champs and white. I'll let that stand out for itself. Like there's no rules. I'll PM you when you're done to get some advice on what you can. Yeah, definitely, yeah, do that. I'll tell you whatever you need to know. That's awesome. Hey, what's up, Tom? New Orleans Saints and uh, not the Dance fan must. Right on, man. I uh, did a Saints shirt a while ago, super cool. Um, I like their logo, it's fun. It's fun to paint. I'm the Midwest, we do a lot of uh, bear stuff, Notre, Notre Dame stuff we do. Uh, what others? Big hair. Uh, oh, that was loud. Hey, thanks for following me, checking out my channel, I appreciate it. Hey, thanks again. Appreciate it. Mucho, mucho mas. Babe Ruth, right there. And uh, if you just check out my channel, I'm doing a custom softball helmet. Uh, and I paint all kinds of stuff, like cars, trucks, helmets. Man, I painted this guy, actually hired me to paint. He had like horses, and he had this huge horse thing. He's a Mexican guy. And he had the huge horse like stable I painted for a sign. He did a rodeo. It was insane. That was pretty cool. I think he rode bulls and stuff too. So I was like, I learned everything about the different types of bulls and the horns. I'm like, it's very specific. Very specific when you're working with uh, people that specialize in something, you know? I'm like, oh, it's a bull, it's a bull. I'm like, nope. Nope. So, yeah, I get to do a lot of crazy stuff. And uh, I think that's cool. I like it. The logo there. Flames. Maybe I'll add some more of that gold in here. I think that might work. Did the Saints for my daughters last year. Oh, yeah, yeah, dude, that was awesome. Yeah, that came out good. Hey, if you got any pictures of that, so send it to me. I'll use it because I'm making a portfolio book. I thought it took some. I'm pretty sure I took some. But everything is on my hard drive, and it's all, like, scrambled. Because I've been doing so many videos. Lost in space, man. Can I make his eye yellow? I can do that. Little, 
A little gold in his eye, yeah. And I'll mix a little bit of gold, even though it's, it's not in his jacket. I think it gives it a cool look. So thanks everybody for checking out my channel and my stream. This is a shorter one since I finished most of it off camera. But if you're just joining, if you're stopping by, drop a like, a share, all that good stuff. That really helps my uh, channel get out there to other people. And uh, yeah, appreciate it. I have a lot of good people saying, uh, come, telling me, like, hey man, I show your stuff all the time. I'm like, awesome, man. Uh, I really, it rocks. I mix, really like hearing that. And uh, people are like, oh, you know, check out your stream a lot. And I'm like, that's cool, man. Because I never really know who watches my stuff and who doesn't. Uh, so I see some people pop in, but it's cool. So... I say I'm going to be done and I want to do like one more thing. One more thing. Will do. I sent some on ad to post some. Oh, oh yeah, I think. You know what? I did see that, man. I appreciate it. Uh, in that yeah, NWI uh, softball page. Thanks. Yeah, you know what? I should have just copied and pasted those. All right, so that's cool. It's all good. And I'll show you guys a close up if it comes off. And then I'll clear coat it and then I'll have a final picture up later. So, Notre Dame right there. Did some like graffiti style stuff. Uh, some flames on the side. And then uh, I got Munster, Babe Ruth, Champs 2018. Some different letters and stuff like that style. Had some fun with it. And then I threw some cool lightning on the side. And uh, up top is the Fighting Irish logo. And uh, you know, I threw some yellow in there, made them really pop, some different. Not the traditional logo exactly, but uh, you know, I like doing my own twist on it and I think they'll appreciate it. And uh, some flames there. So, hey guys, thanks for checking out my channel. I appreciate it. I'm going to be streaming every Thursday at 9 o'clock. And uh, I'm pretty consistent with it, other than the timing and me dropping in and dropping out. But, um, yeah, guys, appreciate it. And